Hey, yo, I'm the owner of this silly emporium, Gregoria, and I would like to welcome you. This building has been here for over 400 years without any silly accidents or happenings, and I hope that your visit to here will be absolutely... Oh, oh no, I've accidentally summoned the club. Get to high ground. Hello, hello. My name is Gregoria, and I would like to welcome you to my silly palace. Of course, not to be confused with any other jungle gyms. This emporium of wackiness has been scientifically proven to be the silliest place on Earth, and I... <laughs> Oh, oh, oh no! I'm summoning the blood! Quickly! Climb the play pal! Hey, uh, I'm just leaving a quick message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Uh, most important thing I think of to bring up is that one of our monster robots is on the loose right now, and I'm pretty sure they want to attack you. So, be on the lookout for that. Anyways, I'm gonna go to bed. <coughs> Toodles! <laughs> wow, you survived. I actually didn't expect you to survive, so I didn't budget to pay all. But, you can have this free coupon for half a burger, and possibly a fry. D see you next time. Hello everybody, my name is Greg Araya, and welcome back to Five Nights at Red... What's going on? I, I put on some weird headset and now I'm here. Who are you people? Why can't I take it off? Where am I? What the f is going on? What? Oh my god. Uh, well, how do I, you know, leave? What? N n a new home? What do you mean? Oh, okay, now I get it. This is a dream, and I should just play along until I wake up, right? Is that all there is? That wait, what's that? Wait, wait, was that an exit door I saw out there? Is that a way to leave? I, I swear I saw- My name? Uh, my name is, uh... uh... Oh god! Why can't I remember my name? Uh, what's my name? <laughs> I don't care, just pick anything. I don't- I- sure. I think I just- uh, I don't really- What did any of that mean? But wait! Wouldn't that more likely mean the exit does exist? Well, I think I'd like to ask him about it, uh, if this was real, which it isn't, because it's a dream. I still don't understand about the adventures. Why even go on them at all? Why not try to find a way to leave? Why are we here again? What are we doing? What is that? I'm sorry! Hello? R Ragatha? That was your name, right? H hey, look. I'm... I didn't mean to leave you behind like that. I... Just... Look at my hand. I... I didn't know what to do. Uh oh Okay, but where can I find him? Uh, okay, I'll get him. You just stay right there. Not that you can really move or anything. Uh, just hang in there. I'll be right back, I promise. Uh, yeah, well, don't worry about it. I'm just gonna go get Kane now. Hello? Kane? We have a bit of an issue here! Kane? Gotta hide, gotta hide, gotta hide! God, where is Kane? That's right! And don't you come back now, you hear? That'll teach you for trying to trick this old bird! Thought you could fool me with that sign, but I was too smart for you! I may not like wet floors, but the smell of fresh meat is just too enticing! <laughs> Whoops! Looks like you're the one that slipped up this time!
I know it was an accident. Isn't this why you came here? To be with me again. I don't understand. I don't understand. Everything is okay. I'm still here. Hello? 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 You have to let me inside the room. Daddy, why won't you let me play with her? Daddy, you let the other children go see her. Why won't you let me go? Daddy just once let me go play with her. She's so pretty and shiny. Didn't you make her just for me? Daddy, she can make balloons. Have you seen her make balloons? Oh, Daddy, let me go to her. Daddy isn't watching. Don't tell Daddy that I'm here. I wanted to watch your show too. I don't know why he won't let me come see you. You're wonderful. Where did the other children go? We need you so that we can hide. We need you so that we can leave. See, here's the thing, Dave. I'm running a business, and time is, well, you know, money. Every second I spend here listening to you babble on, I lose moolah. So, finish your monologue in three sentences, or get out. Dave. Shut up. The. Fuck. Up. You're a fucking idiot. What kind of narcissistic fucking... I've been operating a functioning business for five months and actively avoiding you the entire time. I literally bailed when I saw you in that rotting pizzeria. Oh, God, you reek. I don't want you in here. Uh, go take a bath, stinky. Go on, if you're gonna break into my house and use my possessions, at least take a shower once a year, Christ! What? Right, Dave. I hated working at Freddy's. I hated coming into work at noon, hungover, and being screamed at by our phone-headed boss. I hated wearing a sweaty bear suit for six hours a day. I hated being bitten by dysfunctional, haunted robots. I hated having to look Matt in the eyes every single goddamn day and pretend that I didn't possess the overwhelming urge to peel his skin off so I wouldn't have to see the shape of his creepy ass smile. You know what I love? Coming to the restaurant that I own at noon, hung over. Dragging in dysfunctional, haunted ass robots out of the trash, who I know will bite customers. Yelling at my phone-headed employee, forcing some other poor fucker to wear the bear suit for once. You think any of this was because I loved Freddy's? Or loved you? <laughs> You're a loser, Dave. Henry died 40 years ago, Dave. Move the fuck on! Get another fat iguana, call it Henry, and get an apartment or some shit! Do crack in an alley or some shit, I don't care. Just stop sleeping in my trash. 
You're dead, you idiot. A tree is working hard just to create air for you to pollute with your stench. Go lay down on the ground and become a skeleton, dummy. Holy fuck, I'm trying to run a business here. I make the money, Dave. I roll the nickels. I deal the cards. The game is mine.